Hey guys, this is Joey. Greetings from Limbo Machinery. Welcome back to our channel. So long time no see. We are testing the sleeper beam roll for me machine. In my hand, this is the example of the sleeper beam. Sleeper beam is one important part in the racking system. It can provide more stability for the racking structures. And usually, it's made of the material with a thickness of 1.5 to 2 millimeters, and with the material of cold road steer and the governor steer and let's go and see more details this is the first part of our production line the decoiler this is a manual type of decoiler this is a press arm it can press on the steer coil from it popping up when replacement of the steer coil and this is the coil arch water retainer it can prevent the steer coil from falling up and this is the ex this is the core expansion device it can change the inner diameter from 460 to 520 millimeter and let's go and see more details about the roll forming machine this is the guiding part of our roll forming machine there are four guiding rollers these guiding rollers can keep the steel coil and the roll forming machine on one same center line. It can keep the straightness of the stepper beam. And here are the digital display. We can see the weights between these two guiding rollers from the digital display. It's very convenient and we can change the weights from this roller. And then this is the leveling machine. This is the lifting machine for a steel coil with a thickness over 1.5 mm. It's very necessary to use the lifting machine to flat the surface and relieving the inner stress. And then this is the roll forming machine. This is the main part of our roll forming machine. This roll forming machine has the wall panel structure and a chain driving system. The chains are protected by the cover from dust and also can protect our workers from sudden hurt. And this is the automatic movement on our roll machine. To produce different sizes sleeper beams, we use the automatic part to meet the requirements. The roll forming point on the steel coil can be changed as the movement of the roll forming stations. And there are there are two distance sensors on the right and left side of the roll forming machine. The sensor can prevent the roll forming stations from moving too fast and falling down or can protect the roll forming stations from getting too close to cause the collisions. Usually the step beam requires wearing to have a more stronger connection. And on this production line, we use the sport welding solution. As you can see, the steel coil goes through the welding torches, and the welding can wear the spot on the connection part. And the welding torches can move forward and backward on the wheels. So the roll forming machine can keep working. So the roll forming machine can keep working when welding. And if you want an stronger connection part, we also offer the laser welding solution. Then this is the carting part. Because the steep beam has the closed ship, we use the saw carting to cut on the edge to prevent from the deformation. And we use the cooling system to cool down the temperature on the blade to provide a higher efficiency. And the saw cart means no wastage on per cutting. To improve the production speed of the production line, we use the moving function. The, the cutting machine can move forward and backward so that the roll forming machine doesn't need to stop when cutting. This is all about our production line. If you are interested in this production line, please feel free to contact us. One production line like this requires about 90 working days to produce and we can plan the production for you to ensure a timely start to your project. This is Joey, see you next time.